Hi, once again from True Life Community, Seventh-day Adventist Church. This is Pastor Bob Reynolds. I again hope that you're in good health. You know, years ago, there was a show on TV that really intrigued me. It was called Charlie's Angels. And what intrigued me about this show was it was about these three young ladies who would go on a mission for Charlie. And Charlie, in this whole series, they never saw him. They never met him. But they would go on whatever mission that Charlie sent them on. And sometimes their, their mission was death-defying. It was dangerous. But they would go on this mission. They would do Charlie's bidding. They would do the bidding of this man that they had never seen. <laughs> and you know, if Charlie, a guy named Charlie, could get three angels to go on missions for him, it seems like we as angels could go on missions for someone we've never seen, and that is Jesus. You know, angel means messenger, and it means being a messenger for someone else. Jesus wants us to be an angel, a messenger for him. What kind of a messenger? A person that tells someone else about Jesus and how his love for them can change them and save their lives for eternity. We can be angels. <laughs> Let's pray that God will help us to be angels today in someone's life, shall we? Lord, I thank you for angels, for these messengers. And Lord, I know that in your word, we hear about ambassadors. We hear about angels, messengers to other lands about, about who they represent. And I pray that you will help us to represent you in glorious ways. In Jesus' name, amen. And I want to leave you with this text. It's found in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 20. It says, now then, we are ambassadors for Christ. That means we're messengers or, or, or we're representatives for Christ as though God were pleading through us. Huh. What a message. I hope you'll take it to heart today.